What's going on guys? And uh, today is the new video. So uh, yeah, today we're gonna be putting Velocity Stacks on the 2006 Honda Shadow Bobber Build. The Bobber Build. So we're actually editing right now. I already know how this video came out, which is amazing. So you guys should stick around. Um, yeah, if you guys haven't subscribed yet to the channel, which like 99% of the people watching these videos have not subscribed, it would mean the absolute world to me and I'd really appreciate it. Um, I definitely spent a lot of time making these videos and uh, yeah. So let's get straight to the video. Let's install some parts. Let's get it. Out of the wind we got the filter out as you guys can see this thing's dirtier than a rat sack on a friday night and uh yeah there you go can't sell that now all right it's coming off what a what an interesting part there oh my gosh that's a lot of Dude, I get to clean all this. That's gonna make me so happy, having all that clean. So, what did you take off? Just so I know. So, where did this go? That was on the nipple part. This was on the big part. That was the clip that I was talking about. So, where did this side go? Where did that side go? This? Yeah. It literally was just. It's not even a big gain I get from it. A couple horsepower and some sounds. Yeah. It's all I'm pretty much gonna get, but it looks pretty sick. We'll see in a second what it sounds like.
All right, y'all. We're at the gas station. And what I just showed you guys, oh my God, there's dirt everywhere. What I just showed you guys is, um, so I put, what is that, heat shrink on all the wires so they're separated so they don't like touch each other. And they also don't touch metal. Um, so it doesn't short out the system. So I got that all done. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna tuck them inside, I'll show you. I'm just gonna tuck all these inside back inside here and then if i ever need them i may get lights down here you know something like that and uh so that'll be still there for that but check this out uh, it looks really good it also so like when you rev it you can't really hear it when you uh when you get on it you don't really hear it when you're slowing down and when you're uh when you're kind of at a cruising rate you can really hear like the just kind of like the sound um, but yeah, I'm gonna put this on time lapse. We're gonna like clean the bike real quick. There's a lot of gum and weird crap in there because it, the air box was in there. So we're gonna clean this all up and then we'll do like a little B roll at the end and possibly a little burnout out of here. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one we put on the velocity stacks in this video and they sound well when you do get to hear them they sound pretty darn good and they look amazing or i should say it looks amazing there it is right there one last time for you guys with the little symbol up top tj customs same with the exhaust that's a CJ Custom backdraft exhaust. So, um, so far I like their product. The TJ Custom exhaust, I don't know what it's from, but it's turning like that purple and orange splotchy. And I don't run it with like the choke on in the cold or anything like that. So I'm wondering if I'm doing something wrong or if, you know, if it's a product thing or I don't know, but I'm not gonna blame the product till I know what's wrong with it, you know what I'm saying? Or what, what I'm doing wrong. Uh, but yeah, we got the wires all tucked in. Everything's done. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm going to do a burnout before I say, well, I'm going to say goodbye now, but there's going to be a burnout right about now.